Hello race fans, it's my race here now from NASCAR Heat 4 Custom Livery. Today we're going to be doing Bubba Wallace's um, Black Lives Matter car and it's going to be the best recreation I can do of it in the limitations of the game. And, you know, I'm going to show you how to make that wonderful livery in the paint booth. So keep watching this video to find out how to make it and subscribe if you enjoy. So let's go to the paint booth right now. Hello race fans, ladies and gentlemen, here with another NASCAR Heat 4 custom livery. Now today, I'm going to be doing a livery inspired by the Black Lives Matter uh, Bubble Wallace car, which he raced at Martinsville, and we will be going to Martinsville to show you what the livery looks like. I can't do that swish on the side of the car, but if you want to have this use this livery, this is going to be the best way of doing it in NASCAR Heat 4. I presume that NASCAR Heat 5 will probably have this livery, but... If you can't wait till then, this is going to be the best way. So, cheers to Matt for giving me the idea. Obviously, like I say, last video, uh, after the Talladega, seeing all the, how united NASCAR was as a sport in support of um, the, you know, everything that's happened. It's, you know, it's good to see that and it's be it goes home. So, yeah, today we'll be doing that delivery. So, as you can see in the bottom left of your screen is the, um, the livery I'm going to be trying to replicate or trying to inspired by. So, yeah, what we do, we go to where was it? It's um, this one here. We go to the far right. Once you pick the Monster Energy NASCAR Cup Series Chevrolet Camaro, we go to the far right and we go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Was that nine? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yep, yeah, nine across. So we go for this one. And you'll probably question, well, that looks nothing like it. Bear with. We go to the black. I wish we could make it more of a matte black, but that's about the best we can do if we want it matte black. And that's not dark enough, in my opinion. So there's your choices. I'm going for the stock black. And the orange, it's got to be stock black here. So base paint, black. Stripe on black with stripe two and three. Now, stripe two is the um, top part, and we're going to go for the brown um, that's on the side of the car because the swish I didn't realize, I thought it was just a institutional swish, but it's one's a creamy color, and one's a much uh, a brown color. So that's what we're going to do. The stripe three to get the cream, we go into the customs, and we work our way up to about here. Uh, and that's going to be from the grey. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And we'll just go for whatever it sticks on. I feel that looks pretty bang on. So we go for the number 43B and we go for the white. Uh, in terms of the rims, he uses the black rims, the yellow lug nuts. <laughs> so, yeah. Now we can look at sponsorship. Now... For the hood, there's nothing I could find which was like the two hands united at all. Um, yeah, there was nothing like it. I couldn't find, you know, so I don't think I'm going to put anything here. And I think that's probably best, you know. So, unfortunately, that's the way it's going to have to be. On the side, there is the US Air Force. And with the wings, I thought it looked uh, very similar to the nation nationwide one. I feel that would match it there. That would look good. Um, if you don't like that, there's not really any others. It's a shame because he's got some sponsors which we can't really replicate in this game, unfortunately. But I'm going to put the nationwide sponsor there. Which is just that. The rear quarter, the Black Lives Matter, it's one line of text, big bold and all that. I am thought, maybe stick Brant there. Uh, so stick Brant there, or we need someone else. Procore, maybe. There's none with that sort of text, which is frustrating, but uh, as you see, I'm flicking through. There's some which could work. Um... Safe fits may work, Cirrus would work, but 
So it's vibrations at the end that I don't really like. So I think Brant would probably be the best bet there. In my opinion. Uh, or Procore. And I'm going to choose Procore because of the simplicity of it. And it's one line text. On the deck kit there is nothing there. At all. And there's nothing on the rear TV cam. There was that um, peace sign. Which I did like. But I can't replicate that on the game. But. That will do. So that's my recreation of Bubba Wallace Black Lives Matter car. So if you like that, remember to like, comment, subscribe. And let's go out on track to see what this Civvy looks like. So here we are at Martinsville where this Civvy was used. And it's not... Ugh, it's a difficult livery. It's, it's one of my most difficult ones that I could think of doing. And I love it. I like what it represents. I think there's going to be people out there all you fans out there who like it I'm I like it but I don't feel it looks as near to the so this is more of an inspirer inspired by rather than actual this is what it looks like so it's a shame but like I say hopefully in NASCAR Heat 5 we get this every in all its glory uh, I thought maybe I should put something onto the hood of the car but unfortunately none of them looked like that hand bonding thing but Oh well, you know what, I hope you guys enjoyed today's NASCAR Heat 4 video, anyway I definitely enjoyed making it, I enjoy making these videos for all you guys out there, so if you liked it, remember to like, if you are enjoying these NASCAR Heat 4 custom liveries, remember to subscribe as well because it helps grow the channel that little bit extra, so from here, enjoy some NASCAR Heat 4 and I'll see you for the next video, so until then, have a good one.